What's going on, people? I'm not going to be on this video too long. This young lady behind me, she had a live on TikTok. And the title of her live is, Does Aborted Babies Go to Heaven? Do aborted babies go to heaven? Do they automatically go to heaven? And my answer to that question is no. Now, some people may think, well, the baby's innocent. They did no harm. But you have to re realize how deep sin is, especially if they were born in sin. See, the Bible talks about being born in sin and shaped in iniquity. So if a child is born um, as a product of um, incest, fornication, adultery, right? Any type of sin that's against the nature of God, if that child was born or better yet conceived, out of sin and out of abominations because in this day and time you have gay dudes and gay females getting together so the dude may become a transgender female and the female becomes a transgender dude and then those two decide to come together and out of that union, they conceive a child, right? Well, if that child is aborted or if that child dies, would that child go to heaven? My answer is still no, because the child was born in sin. They just wasn't shaped in iniquity and they really had no uh, time or chance to repent. So you have a lot of females that's sending their child to hell. They're offering their children up as a sacrifice. Okay. So this is not like illegal immigrants crossing the border just to be able to give birth to a child so that the child will automatically become a citizen. That's their uh, ticket to the United States. So you have pregnant women that would try to get to the American side to be able to give birth to a child so that that child can become a citizen automatically. This is not like an illegal child, a legal person crossing the border to give birth to a child and the child becomes a citizen. It's nothing like that. So just because you abort your baby, you're not doing that child a favor. By aborting that child, thinking that the child could break into paradise. You have females that's trying to break their children into paradise. And it don't work like that. Because they were born in sin. They were born out of sin. They were conceived out of sin and by you aborting them you're not giving them a free ticket to paradise you're giving them a free ticket to hell all right so that's my answer and maybe i'll make a more uh detailed video and i'll provide scriptures to you okay uh because we're living in a very evil time now where not only you have illegal immigrants crossing the borders and given rights, more rights than the citizen, then you think that you can conceive a child, abort that child, and then the child, you're doing the child a favor. You think by sending that child into paradise, you think that child would automatically gain entrance into paradise because of the fact that they are a child. There's a scripture in the Bible where the Most High says that he knew you from your mother's womb. 
So the Most High knew you even before you were conceived. He already knew the outcome of your life here on earth. Okay, so yes, it's true that we don't know what that child could have been. The child maybe could have repented. But we don't know that because you never gave that child a chance to live. So the mother not only sacrificed her child to demons, but she held the door open. She held hell's door open for that aborted child. So feedback, tell me what you think until next time. I'm fearless.